Hi, this is Justice with LearnBuildBox.com. I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to make a rolling bullet. Kind of like a bomb. Not exactly a bomb. Uh, hope, hopefully I'll get that figured out soon. If any of, of uh, you guys watching know how to create a bomb that actually explodes uh, strike boxes out, uh, that would be great. A time delay is something I'm also trying to figure out how to do. So if anyone knows how to do that, please let me know. Um, write it in the comments or send me a message. Alright, so right now, here I'm a rolling bomb. I'll demonstrate what this is, a rolling character bullet. Um, let me see this over here. There, and it destroys the enemy. Alright, so what I did is I have a power up set in the game field. Um, which one is it? I think it's this one. All right, so let's see. Okay, it's not in here. It's actually back over here. Um, so we'll go to actions. We'll find the power up. It's better done. Action animation is what I have it set at. And this is a bullet. It's the item that you saw there. It's got a little transparency around the outside of it. Um, and then I dropped this on here. So I didn't actually have anything on here before. So. Uh, I took an object from over here, I'll show you. For some reason this object does not show up well in here, but uh, not if you click on this it goes away. So click here, bring up this action animation window, and then what you do is you would drag it over. I'll show you basically what that looks like. Change this to enemy, or I'm sorry, character bullet, and then you would play with all of these over here, uh, movement type, physics. Actually, let's get rid of this and we'll click on this. You can see it. Movement type physics. I have this set at 15, angular velocity 4, collide, destroy enemy, spawner I have set, and spawn rate 0.4 because I didn't want it to be a constant stream coming out. Um, all right. So that is an action animation. Uh, one thing that you want to be able, or you want to do here is make sure you have a keyboard key set. I have R set to play that and uh, another thing you want to be aware of is you you want to have it set to over here character not power up overlay and single play I have this also set to a duration of 0.3 so that it doesn't play um, too long and this is more important for animation than it is for some of the other stuff but something you do want to keep track of um, I do have this set for some reason to gameplay, but I don't think that's actually doing anything. That might be why he's jumping backwards uh, when he shoots the bullet. I haven't quite been able to figure that part out yet. All right, so demonstrating that one more time. Press the button. That's the R button. It comes down and destroys the enemies. These can all be set to transparent or set on top of each other to get them out of the way for when you're doing this. Uh, for right now, I leave them on the screen just because it doesn't bother me for testing purposes. All right, guys, I hope that helps. Uh, send any requests over to me, and remember to subscribe to the channel to get updates.